Hi everybody and welcome to this video which is going to be a complete step-by-step -step guide on how to edit videos on Canva so you will be able to know all the basics and all the other features that is very necessary for you to be able to edit a good video on Canva. So if you're a complete beginner or if you have already tried Canva before, well, this is going to be perfect for you. What you're going to do firstly is to, of course, go into Canva. So go into Canva and then log into your account. What you're going to do after this is to, is to just find this little search bar in here, as you can see, and then just search for video because it should take you to this page right here. Now on this page, what you're going to do is to click on create a blank video. So click on create a blank video because what will happen then is that we will be taken to this page right here. And in here, we're able to actually start editing our video. So either you can click right here where it says upload and you can upload an existing file to be able to edit, which is going to probably be what you want to be able to do. So if you click on upload and then either drag your file into the upload section or click on select file, and select that specific file, what you will be able to do after this is to just drag your video in here and then you can start editing. But for this tutorial, I'm just going to take a random video. So I'm just going to search for video in here and elements. This is also possible, by the way. And then I'm going to click on videos right here and we can take, let's take this one right here is actually really good, I think. So I'm going to take this one. So the first step, if you want to be able to remove the audio on the video itself, you can find, you can just like select the video. By the way, I don't know if you saw, but I dragged that video and I actually placed it in here as you can see, so that you, you can actually have this on full screen. So as you can see, the video is now in full screen, but if you don't want it to have like in full screen, you can minimize it in here, for example, like this and you can play around as much as you want to. And you can basically play around and see how you want the video to be structured basically. But for this tutorial, I'm just going to make it full screen. And if you want to be able to remove any kind of like noise or sorry, any kind of audio or noise in this video, well then you can just click on the video and click on the volume symbol in here, just drag it to zero or to whatever you want to be able to have on the video basically. And now we can start editing the video. So let's see here. This video is about 24 seconds long. As you can see, it's a pretty good video, but I want to be able to edit it, of course. So what I'm going to do, the first step I'm going to show you, if you want to be able to cut a specific uh, like point in the video, well, then what you're going to do is to just drag your mouse and then select the perfect point. So for example, let's say that I want to be able to cut in here. So I'm going to select this one right here. Then I'm going to uh, right click on my mouse basically. And as you can see, I should now be taken to this page right here. So actually I'm going to, sorry, I'm going to actually right click once again. Let's see. And yeah, perfect. As you can see, I'm now here. We can click on duplicate page as you can see. So we can duplicate it right here, or we can also, I'm just going to go back. You can also click on split. So the split option is going to be the option to be able to actually cut a specific like uh, video as you can see or a specific time. So we can cut right here and we can, for example, make sure that this one is a little bit more faster. So as you can see, I before I cut right here, so I'm just going to play to you. And as you can see, it does like uh, cut here and goes to straight to another frame or another video right here. And what I'm, what I can also do, we can make actually a new cut in here, as you can see, what you can also do if you, uh, for example, made any mistakes, let's say that my latest cut right here was a mistake. I can click on this button right here to reverse it. So as you can see, the mistake is now reversed. I can click on it again, as you can see, until I get to the original like uh, video right here, as you can see. And now another thing that is really cool with Canva is that you can resize the video right here. So for example, let's say that uh, like this video is way too long and you want to be able to resize it. Well, then you can do it right here. It's very, very simple. And as you can see, it just resize like very quickly. And right now the video is 15 seconds and before it was 24 seconds. So if you want to be able to go back, you can either click on this one right here or you can just drag it once again. Uh, Canva will remember the file uh, length basically just so you know, which is also pretty awesome in my opinion. So yeah, let's say we want to be able to start editing. So the first five seconds or so is going to be the intro. So I'm going to click on split page right here. This is going to be the intro. What I'm going to do now is to click on text right here. Then what I'm going to do, I'm going to either, you can either actually select any text in here, for example, or search for a font, or what you can also do in here is to, for example, select any of these ones right here, which is pretty cool. So for example, we can take this one as an example. 
then I'm going to just delete this one. And then in here, I'm going to write welcome. Let's write welcome. I'm going to resize this one a little bit bigger. Perfect. And I'm going to fit it right in the middle, as you can see. So now the text right here, welcome, as you can see. So we get this uh, like a beautiful font, like our intro and welcome text. But let's say that you want the welcome text to just be at three seconds, for example, right? So you're going to click on the text itself right here, click and uh, right click as you can see, because then you should actually get to this page right here. And as you can see, we get a couple of uh, options, but you're going to click on show timing in here. And then you're just going to uh, like, you can see resize this one to three seconds about that, if you want to be able to have it three seconds, right? So let's play it again. Let's see what's going to happen. As you can see, the welcome is just for three seconds, which is perfect. But you can you can stre like stretch it as much as you want in here for this frame, as you can see. But let's uh, have this at three seconds. So yeah, welcome, three seconds, perfect. As you can see, let's play it. Yeah, great. So let's move on. Let's move on to this second part right here. So the second part right here, let's say that we want to resize it. We want it to be at this uh, like stage right here, as you can see. So there's a couple of things you can do now to be able to actually edit your video. So for example, let's click on the video itself. For example, let's say that you want to like be able to animate this one, for example. You want this one to uh, fade in or breathe out, for example, the next, uh, like the next thing right here, as you can see. Let's take fade and see how it looks. So the welcome text, I'm just going to actually fast forward. And the next frame is going to be like that, for example. I mean, you can play around and see exactly what you want to be able to have. It's like, yeah, this one is just going to be a random tutor tutorial that I've got that is going to show you exactly what you can do, basically. So we have a fade in this one. If you want to, you can even crop the video if you want to do that as well. Uh, you can even in here, you can, for example, like you can cut it out like even more, but I mean, I wouldn't actually suggest you use this. I like to use this one instead, like drag it out in here. I think it's much, much more uh, efficient to do so, but you can do that in the crop uh, section right here. Oh, sorry, not the crop section. I'm just going to go back. The This one right here, the uh, scissor section in here. So now what you can do is to click on edit video right here, as you can see. You can even add filters if you want. So for example, you can add this filter right here and you can play around with it or you can add this one or yeah, you can see you can click on see all and you can see all the filters that you can actually add to your video if you want to. You can even click right here where it says adjust and you can adjust the warmth of the video, for example, as you can see, and you can even have it more contrast, for example, it's completely up to you. There is a lot of options in here for you to choose. So choose the one that you want to be able to have, play around with it. Canva has a lot of things that you can do just so you know. So let's see how it's going to look now. It's not going to be so good, I think, but yeah, let's see. Yeah, as you can see, we did some editing here just to play around, right? So this is one of the things that you can do. And another thing, you can actually have elements. I don't know if you saw it before, but like I actually pulled this video up here from elements. So if you search for video in here, for example, then you can just play around and see which video that you want to be able to add to your editing, but you can also be more specific. So let's be more specific and see like, right? business or something like that. You want something to do with business, right? So you're going to have a video. And as you can see here, we can add next video right here. It can be this one as an example, right? And as you can see, Canva gives us this free video right here for us to choose. This one, by the way, this one you have to pay for the pro one. So you have to have a pro uh, subscription or you can even uh, like have like their monthly subscriptions as well. But those uh, that those like videos that don't have this pro uh, like symbol in here, you can just use them for free, just so you know. So this one is also great if you want to be able to add it to your uh, video editing or to your video, uh, like a cut in between something, maybe you're talking about something and you want to have like, like a, just a random stock image or stock footage playing, Canva is perfect for that as well. As you can see, there's a lot of free ones that we can use in here. So you can just play around with it and you can even add shapes as you can see. And I'm just going to go back to this one. And as you can see, you can add shapes. You have, you have graphics in here, stickers, and the shapes are right here. As you can see, I'm going to click on see all. So this is the shape that you can add straight to your video if you would want to, basically. Let's say like you want to write some text in here, for example, like I'm just going to write like test right here. 
and then just drag it into this little box right here. I'm going to, I mean, this doesn't look good, I know guys, but just, <laughs> just bear with me. Let's see, yeah, as you can see, it, it sticks right here. So you can play around with it and just, you know, have it as much, like resize it or yeah, have the elements that you want or the shapes that you want in your video. I'm just showing this to you so that you can actually play around with yourself. This frames right here, by the way, uh, this one is also pretty cool. I use them sometimes. And if you click on this one right here, what you can do, I'm just going to remove this one right here and going to place this right here. So let's say that I want an image in here, like a logo or whatever that you want to be able to have. I'm going to go back. I'm just going to uh, write photo in here. Just take a random photo. Let's see here, photos right here. Let's say that I would like to have this, maybe this photo right here, right? So I'm just going to, sorry, I'm going to drag it in here. And as you can see, I have this photo right here now, which is awesome. As you can see, this is uh, an option for you as well, if you want to be able to add this to your video. So yeah, uh, there is free photos for you to use in here. There's free videos for you to use in here as well. Audio, uh, some audio might be, I think a lot of those are actually, um, not for free, unfortunately, but there probably will be some audio you can find that you can use. Uh, yeah, this one's right here, for example. So if you want to be able to add audio to your video, starting from here, for example, just drag it here, then click on the audio, and then you can have the audio on your video as well here playing uh, in the background, basically. So this is some of the great features about Canva. So you can just, it's very easy, by the way, to use Canva, in my opinion. It's a great video editing pr platform. It's simple. It's, it's basically drag and drop and you can play around with it. You can upload your own files to it, of course, if you click on upload in here. And yeah, basically this is a tutorial on how to edit your videos on Canva. And I hope that I was able to help you to get started.